Hi friends, Brooke Boone here, founder of Holy Yoga, and I have the opportunity and the pleasure to connect with you about our July theme for Holy Yoga, which is rest. I don't know about you, but uh, rest is much needed in my life um, at right about now, like the first two quarters of the year, I feel like we run pretty hard if you're in any type of ministry or business, which holy yoga, you are in ministry, um, we run pretty hard um, after the Lord and what he has placed before us, and he is really intentional in his word about rest. He is such a good and kind and generous God to instruct us um, about what we need before we even realize that we need it. So our intention this uh, July, ministry-wide, and hopefully you'll really embrace this, is rest. I love in the Gospel of Mark, in the first chapter, um, ch verses 1 through 35, Jesus is, Mark is really intentional about saying Jesus is running hard. He is, it's basically the entire um, ministry up until about 32 or 33 years old of Jesus in 35 short verses, but I love that in verse 35, it says that Jesus retreats to a solitary place to pray. Um, in the midst of a very busy life and in his ministry, I mean, he's got a ton of momentum. It doesn't even seem right that he would retreat and go and be alone. In fact, his disciples find him in the very next verse and say, come on, people are waiting for you. And he says, after he spent time alone with the Father, um, we have a new direction. There's somewhere else that we need to go. So this rest piece, specifically when we're running um, the race marked out for us in Christ, this rest piece is really important because um, we as humans can be swayed by momentum and success and numbers. And God often, the Father, wants to draw us away and, and remind us who we are and what our real value and real truth and real worth is. So we're hoping, we're doing that ministry-wide, Holy Yoga, the entire core team. There's no new business. We just kind of keep the lights on in July. Um, and we just really enter a place of rest. We want to hear from the Father. We want to be in the presence of the King um, and see where where are we, God? Drop the pin on our own lives and go, where are we, God? Are we on the right track here um, in our families, in our marriages, in our relationships, in ministry? And um, is there another way that we need to be going? So that's our intention this, uh, this month. And I pray that you would really embrace that for yourself. Um, I know those of you who have children, they're all out of school. Um, that used to really freak me out. Like, what am I going to do with my kids? And now I'm like, what do I get to do with my kids? It's a little bit different um, because the intention is to really enjoy them in rest. So I pray that that is something that you can embrace this, uh, this July. And we're coming back in August. You know, there's always another day, praise be to God. So um, if you feel rest is out of out of reach for you in this season, I want to encourage you that that's not true, um, that God doesn't intend for it and make it a priority unless it was for everybody, including you, no matter what you're doing at this point in your life. All right, so I hope you have a great summer. We will see you in August, and um, make sure and rest. Take care. Bye.